10 Tips to Increase Website Loading Speed in 2022 Page speed is a Google ranking factor. Therefore, your website's loading speed directly affects your website's standing in search engines. These 10 tips will make your website load faster in 2022. But before we get started, subscribe to our channel. And if you are on YouTube, click the alert notification so you don't miss out on our upcoming videos. First, implement lazy loading for ads. The concept of lazy loading is simple. With this technique, the ad load is delayed until the banner is in view. Lazy loading can be effective in three ways. First, it improves your ad viewability score because the ad will display right when the user is most likely to see it. Second, it increases the loading speed of your page. Third, it reduces overall page latency. Optimize website for mobile. Today, almost 60% of all global web traffic originates from mobile. Not surprisingly, Google predominantly uses mobile version of the content for indexing and ranking. It's crucial that your web page is mobile friendly and adjusted for smaller screen sizes like iPhone 12 mini or Google Pixel 5. You should also pay attention to the size of your mobile pages. Experts say it should not exceed 500 kilobytes. Also, Make sure to regularly test the mobile performance of your site in Google Search Console. Optimize images. Images take up the most page resources to download, which results in a longer loading time for your site. In most cases, images are too heavy or the format isn't right. So how to reduce the file size of an image? First, before uploading any images, Make sure to compress them using tools like TinyPNG or Skoosh. This will reduce their size without sacrificing the quality. Second, implement lazy loading. With this technique, any image that isn't visible to the user can be loaded at a later point in time. Third, use the right formats. As a rule of thumb, PNGs are better for graphic images, while JPEGs are better for photos. Next-gen image formats like WebPS can also be effective, but some browsers like Internet Explorer don't support them yet. Fourth, use CSS sprites. With CSS sprites, you can combine frequently used images like logos and buttons and generate one CSS code that will load them all at once. This will improve the website's speed because instead of downloading all images one after another, they'll be downloaded as one. Fifth, use responsive images. With this technique, images will dynamically adapt to browser's window size. Use a content delivery network. A website's loading speed is directly affected by the user's location. For users who are physically further away from your server, the website's loading time will be higher. A CDN is a geographically distributed network of servers. It allows access to web content regardless of the user's location. With CDN, the traffic is distributed between multiple servers, which helps the user get information as fast as possible. Using a CDN can dramatically speed up time to first byte on both desktop and mobile. And it's especially important for publishers with geographically diverse traffic. However, certain CDNs perform significantly better than others, so keep this in mind when choosing the provider for your site. Fix 404 errors. The popular page not found message is a notification used by search engines to indicate that a specific web page or an entire website no longer exists. 404 errors not only irritate users, but also significantly harm websites' performance. To avoid them, redirect users from the broken pages to the working ones and regularly keep an eye on your broken pages report. Implement browser caching. When a user visits your web page for the first time, his browser needs to download a lot of information, like HTML document, style sheets, and JavaScript files. Browser cache stores all these elements on the visitor's side, so the next time a user comes to your page, this information is already stored there. As a result, the page loads faster and the user experience is better, 
By the way, browser cache can decrease server load time by 80%. Minify CSS, JavaScript, and HTML. Website builders like WordPress can sometimes create messy code or add unnecessary files that slow down your website. For example, when you add a new plugin. Minifying means optimizing the code by removing spaces, line breaks, comments, and other unnecessary characters. The result is a shorter file version that requires fewer bytes to download. Reduce redirects. Web page redirects forward visitors to a different URL than the one they requested. This happens when the content was previously available on a different URL than now. This process is really important when you move or delete pages, but it creates additional HTTP requests which require extra processing time. Having too many redirects can negatively impact speed, particularly on mobile devices. To maintain the speed of your web pages, consider keeping only the essential redirects. It's also recommended to use direct links when redirecting pages on your website. This will minimize redirect chains and enhance the performance of your entire website. Use a premium DNS service. All web hosts provide pre-DNS hosting. We are confident that your website has it at this very moment. DNS is one of the primary factors determining server response time. However, to improve this time, you need a fast DNS provider. Switching to premium DNS hosting can boost your site's speed by up to 40%. Just like with website hosting, there are faster and slower DNS providers, so choose wisely. Reduce third-party scripts. Third-party scripts are any external scripts that are embedded in your website through a third-party code. For example, an embedded YouTube video, Twitter integration, or a chatbot. They usually add functionality to your website and offer many useful features, like social share buttons, comments, and analytics. However, they also add up additional loading time for the website. In fact, a study found that each third-party script increased page load times by 34 milliseconds. While it might seem like all these cool features are worth the extra loading time, your best bet is to keep only the essential ones. Ask yourself, do you really need chatbot functionality on all your pages? For example, we kept the chatbot feature only on the home page, and this increased our PageSpeed Insights score by 25 points. Pretty cool, right? And that's a wrap. Remember, improving your page speed is a tedious process, but an essential one for any digital publisher. If you want to maintain the best website loading speed while showing ads on your website, Set up ad team can help you. We offer a free website loading speed audit for our clients where you'll receive custom recommendations for your site. You'll find the contact information in the description or just leave a comment and we'll make sure to reply. Bye and see you next time.